As strong storms move their way across the Ozarks, powerful wind and even tornadoes cause damage to trees, power lines, and even some homes. Now, the owners of this house in Norwood say that they're just glad they weren't home at the time this happened. If I would have been here, I think my life, mine and her lives would have been taken. Jack and Judy Chadwell raised their family in this home and are thankful that they were gone at the time the tornado ripped off the roof and created all of this damage. I think everything destroyed. We got a few things out of the cabinets and stuff, but uh, all the stuff in there is destroyed. What, what the tornado didn't take, the rain come in on it last night, and you couldn't do much last night because of so much rain and water. So we came back this morning and tried to assess things and see what we're going to have to do. After events like this, emergency managers come by to make sure that families are getting connected to help through insurance or agencies like the Red Cross. There's a lot of extensive damage. No injuries to at, as of this moment, and that's the most important thing. We can replace property, but uh, nobody was injured. This family's home has a basement that they have gone into for shelter from previous storms, but they never imagined that it would be their house in the tornado's path. We've never been in a storm like this. We've had storms, but uh, you look at something, a warning, and you think, well, it'll never happen to me. You know, it'll happen to everybody else, but it doesn't happen to me. But sometimes it comes home to me. Which is why it's always important to have a plan. While we are still early in the spring severe weather season, it seems like this that proved that the time to prepare is now. In Norwood, I'm meteorologist Liz McGiffin.